that technology is supposed to have made things easier. And I know they say it isn't listening to us, but I do think it is. Like, you might be talking about toasters in the morning. Later on that day, you'll get a message somewhere on your phone going, why don't you buy a toaster, you moron? Go, I suppose I do need a toaster. Maybe it'll make it easier if I buy things online. It doesn't make it easier, because as soon as you bought the toaster, they go, why don't you write a review about that toaster you just bought? I think, well, who's got time to write reviews about toasters? You go on the website, turns out loads of people have got time to write reviews about toasters. And I do think that the people who comment online about anything are the same people who, in the old days, would have turned up at a public hanging. <laughs> Most of the time, they won't even let you on the website anyway, because they start off by going, well, do you accept all cookies? What on earth are cookies? I just thought they were biscuits for Americans who can't spell. <laughs> so I go, no, I don't accept cookies, thank you. I don't believe in accepting sweets from strangers. I learned that in assembly. They go, well, you have to manage all cookies. Oh, suddenly I'm the line manager of biscuits, am I? <laughs> Fine, I'll accept your cookies now. Now can I come on your website? No, you can't come on our website. You might be a robot! <laughs> Not a robot, I'm a gay man with a shiny bald head. What sort of robot would I be? C-3PO. <laughs> anyway, they say, no, you might be a robot. Prove to us you're not a robot. I go, okay, fine, I can prove I'm not a robot. They go, okay, click on the squares with traffic lights in there. <laughs> well, that's easy, because the traffic lights are in the middle square, so that's easy, but, oh, hang on, they do go into the next square, but just a tiny little bit. So, do you want me to click on that bit as well, or do you just mean the main bit? Oh, is there someone I could ask? I don't... No, you just mean the main bit. Do you mean the lamppost it's attached to? No, you just mean the main bit with the traffic lights. I'll just click on the main square. That's what you mean, it's the main square. I'll click on that. Is that what you mean? That's what you mean? No, wrong. You seem a bit like a robot to us. I'm not a robot. I promise I'm not a robot. Okay, we'll give you another chance. Try and read this joined up handwriting. <laughs> You know robots can't read cursive scripts! Oh, fine. I think that's an H, or is it an ampersand? Is that an O, or is it a Q? I don't know, I don't know. I don't know, is that a joined up X, or is it two twos back to back? Oh, I don't know, I don't know, I don't know. No, robot! Oh, I promise I'm not a robot. Please give me one last chance. Okay, one last chance. Click on the box that says, I'm not a robot! <laughs> I promise I'm not a robot. You know robots can't lie. I clicked on the box. Please, now, can I come on your toaster website? Now you can come on our toaster website. You go on the toaster website, though, the first thing that happens is a pop-up comes up. It's this woman called Geraldine. She's got a sharp blonde bob and a headset on. She goes, hi, how can I help you? Geraldine's a blooming robot!